Okay, so here's another one. Understanding how electrostatic potential energy scales with charge and separation. These two are almost identical. I just did a video on that one. Almost identical, the concepts are identical. So let me go back over here to my whiteboard and say, remember now, more stable means lower energy. Let's put a couple points here we learned in our last video too, and that was, one of them was here. Wait, now let me go to here. One of them was, that like charges repel or they're high energy okay and then unlike charges attract okay and they're lower energy Okay. All right. So those are two. Those are three sort of little pieces that I'd like you to keep in mind. All right. Let me get rid of this. Uh, let me shut this door here. I just went down the hallway on a skateboard. I'm not sure if that's legal, but that sure would be very tempting for me if I had a skateboard. All right. So let's go back now to the question. And the question was here: understanding how electrostatic potential energy scales with charge and separation. So here's the question. Decide how the electrons in the following table would be listed if they were listed in, in, in order of increasing electrostatic potential. Okay, so let me come over here. I'm gonna add a layer. We'll get here. File, add image. Okay, now look at this here now. Okay, so let's come here. Decide how these things. Uh, let's 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 order these. Okay. So what I'm going to do when I get something like this, and you should too, I am going to draw a picture. So it looks like I've got some distances here: one, three, and basically five, right? So the the bottom one I'm going to draw first. It's one point one. So it looks like I've got. Uh, Decide how electrons in the following table would be listed. So in this one, I've got an electron, which I'm going to draw as a little black ball. It's got a minus on it. And it is 1.1 nanometers away from a cation with a charge of plus 3. So I'm going to go to right about here. Yeah, I'm going to do this in a different color. Plus 3. Okay, let's go back to black now. All right, and now let's come over here. This one's 3.1. 1, 2, 3.1. Little black electron right here, right? And it's uh, oh, another chart, another plus 3. So let me come over here. 1, 2, th one, one, two 3. Right about here. Plus 3. Okay. Now another that's aha, okay. So this is one, two, three electron. And this is the same distance as the one below it, but this only has a plus two on it, right? And so let's do it again. One, two, three, four, five. And that's got See, right there, that's about right here. Plus two, this is, this is drawing a picture as you can see is much better. I'm trying to do this in your head. Okay, so which of these is best? Which of these is best? Well, the when I say best, I mean most stable. And most stable, I mean lowest energy okay oh these are these I can't click here I couldn't click it I think even on the other thing so hopefully uh, you click it. I think it's gonna be like lowest energy rank them from highest to lowest okay yeah yeah that's right one no 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 it's, it's lowest to highest that select one next to the the electron with the lowest electrostatic potential energy that's the best right the lowest potential energy and this is the one right here I can see it 
I can see that this is the lowest because look, they're closest. Do you, do you agree? I got a plus three and a minus one. This is attractive. And that means they really liked each other. Plus and a minus. They really like each other. They're close and the charge is big. So this is one, right? Okay, now these are both closer than that one. And this has a bigger charge. That's gonna be two, right? Because this is the second happiest. The happiest is right here. And it's the most stable. And so it's gonna be the lowest energy. So one next to the lowest, two next to the second lowest, okay? And it looks like now the question is, which of these is happier? It's negative and a plus that are, that are attracted to each other. And the, if they're happiest, it means they're the closest. They're closer, right? So that's going to be three. And this one's the last. All right. So that's how they scale with charge and separation, right? The higher the charge, the more they want to be together if they're opposite in sign. And the closer they are, the more they, the, the happier they are, or the more they want to be together if they're opposite in sign. Okay, and then of course the converse is true for all of those that are light charges. All right, hope that's helpful.